Hey guys and welcome to the video and I hope that you are feeling awesome. Alright guys, if you watched last week's vlog you will know exactly where I am right now. However, if you haven't, I am in a place called Woodenall and I'm visiting Yvonne's mum and her brother. I'm currently in a location where I've always been very, very curious about, right? Um, where I am at at the moment is literally what you would look like in the middle of a field, right? If you look at this map now guys where i am stood is where i'm circling right now however if i bring you over to this location guys just in here guys this used to be a canal if you look at this map you can clearly see that this was a canal at one point for many 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 years um i've been coming over here and i've seen this bridge what is the purpose of building the bridge that high there so as we get closer to the road you can see here how the road just in that section there gets it higher right i'm interested to see if there is any hole or anything in this direction there now these buildings here i don't really know what the purpose of these are but they look like some sort of chicken coops or something <laughs> not sure right let's have a look here over here well that would have been like the opening there to the canal would have been a lot more lower down so try and visualize all this across there went literally shot straight off in that direction and i've just noticed a bit of metal up here and i'm interested to see if i get a closer look to that here guys but that's what i was talking about here so now if i cross this road here i'll show you the other side and in this section here would have been the other side of the canal and which would have gone that direction there but as you can clearly see it's a tad dangerous really and i am not wearing my usual uh, gear here so anyway i'm gonna go in and uh, have a little bit more of an explore in this area and uh, head back to yvonne's mum's because uh, it's slightly getting a bit too dark however guys I do have a time-lapse video that I have started to create about two to three hours ago so I am definitely interested in seeing you know what comes of that but anyways I'm gonna go and uh, as I said go and see Yvonne's mum and catch up and uh, see what they've been up to I am on a mission today one thing I forgot to mention me and Yvonne are on our holiday and it is the beginning of December and I thought do you know what this year I want to be so much more organized so I'm popped into Tesco's in Hensford to do a little bit of looking around here I want to go to B&M and also I have to pop to Argos also guys I've got to get a secret Santa present because in work um, we're doing a secret Santa and I really do enjoy doing it do you know for once it's nice just to be able to sort of have a nice gentle walk about Tesco's it's nice not to bump into any of my colleagues because I don't like to uh, show them what I've got and especially if I see the, the person I've got the secret Santa for they'll be like, who's that for type of thing <laughs> I am now done in Tesco's and now I've got to pretty much play the waiting game guys because uh, B&M is not quite open yet and uh, I must admit I might enjoy looking at the sky because look at this sky right now It's absolutely amazing how quickly the sky changes isn't it well, I've still got a little bit more time to wait, so I thought I'll have a little peek at Hensford's uh, railway station and uh, see if I can get some trains and some pictures from there, because that'd be absolutely awesome. Well, I am glad that I decided to uh, get to the car when I did, because it's now started persisting it down. Anyway, guys, I am feeling so freaking awesome now that I've sorted out my Secret Santa present because there is absolutely nothing worse than trying to find a present for somebody that you're not 100% sure what they're into or what they like or what they don't like, etc. I'll tell you something, it does pay to have a good old chat to your colleagues because you do find out some information. However, some major news for you guys. Um, the last couple of weeks, uh, Yvonne has applied to be a counsellor for Rougie Town Council and today is the day of her interview so uh, fingers crossed guys you know she does really really well you my baby boy it's 
Siling, siling, siling. <laughs> ah, siju. What's it? <laughs> well guys many hours have passed and i have been literally on a roll i've got home i wrapped up you know a lot of christmas presents and also i wrapped up the secret santa present as well um i also done a lot of editing and i've uploaded a lot of content to the channel and also to my page uh, yvonne's just gone upstairs to go and get herself ready for her interview you know she is really getting nervous and i think it's good because it's always good to have that element of nerves there because i suppose it shows that you're passionate and you, and you really really want it we are now back in the car and guess who we have with us yvonne hello hello there hello right we are both now off to the town council to uh, hopefully find out if you're going to be a councillor. I'd like to introduce you to Councillor Burgess. Look at that, she got in, guys. How do you feel now? Um, pleased, excited, and... Wow. Exactly. <laughs> Just wow. It was absolutely so really, really brilliantly and cool to be able to witness all of this. But anyway, guys, we're going to enjoy the rest of our evening and you're yet to tell your mum. That's right, so, yes. So, yeah, wow, guys. So, congratulations. Thank well you. done. Congratulations. Thank you. Well guys, it looks like we uh, had some extra snow this week. I wasn't expecting to wake up this morning and see snow on the ground. However guys, I am here doing a time-lapse video of this view I've got right now. And it's absolutely beautiful. Been here for, oh, you're not able to see it, but I've been here for less than 20 minutes. I would have loved to have got to this location a lot more earlier, but I have been so busy today. Um, I've been catching up with editing, sorting some stuff out, like John's adventure stuff, and um, looking up a few more adventure areas for the future. But the main thing I've been so excited about doing today was taking Yvonne to the uh, Rougie Town Council building so she can then finally sign on the dotted line and become the newest councillor and I am so pleased for her oh my god guys I am stood here right literally freezing me knackers off so to speak and the sky is being so beautiful right now well right, we'll take a little bit of a wander over in this direction here guys I can't go too far because I've left my camera there but you can't really see it on camera there's that that sky there is pink absolutely beautiful but yeah absolutely fantastic sky we've got tonight i'm going to carry on doing this bit of recording then i'm going to make my way home and uh, i'm looking forward to seeing what yvonne's been up to because she is literally so like oh i've got to look into this i want to look into this i want to look this up i want to read this so i've uh, kind of left her uh, getting on with it whilst i uh, quickly popped out to hopefully capture an awesome uh, little bit of a sunset here so uh, i will leave you guys with with that video and uh, hope you like. Wow, this weather today is literally all over the place this morning. Me and Yvonne is popping into town because we're going to the artisan market. Now, we've never been to this market before, so this is going to be a new experience for us. So I thought, why not bring you guys along with us and uh, we can experience it all together for the first time. We are now off to uh, go and check out the artisan market and uh, Yvonne has got her own little camera. She's going to be doing a little bit of recording, so it'll be interested to see what she captures and also I am going to be doing a live video so if you haven't already checked that out go and check that out I will leave a link to that in the description of this video but anyway we best crack on
That was good, guys. That was really, really good. You're alive. <laughs> Something you can all see oh, that is too. so fab, isn't it? That's going live at the moment. This yeah. was for my vlog. Nice one. Yeah. Hey, look at that. We've got some councillors here. <laughs> yeah. For me personally, I like that a lot of people have came here today to spend some time here looking at all the different markets and also looking at all of the, maybe the shops that are around here. But I've got to say, absolutely wonderful ambience here. I love kids when they do that. How are you? I'm doing good. I'm doing good, you? This is the chair of Bougie Town Council, guys. And this lovely lady has given me permission to share this wonderful video I created today on her page. Uh, I can't wait to share that later, but thank you. Guys, if you want to come down and see the Artisan Market, it is here, I think, every uh, sort of the Saturdays, first Saturday or something of the month. So if you want to come down, you know, see these wonderful uh, market stores that we've got, that'll be absolutely awesome. It looks like we have Yvonne back with us. What have you been up to there, Yvonne? Yes, I've been talking to Jamie. Yeah. Oh, he's just found me. Yeah. Well, there's actually a screen, a movie screen for the children and the soldiers' children to watch movies as well. I know, it's Fantastic. awesome. Over here, we've got Dave playing music right now. Oh, we need so. to go and have a look. But anyways, me and Yvonne are going to enjoy looking about this place for a little bit more and then we're going to head on home and get on with some things around the house. <laughs> Perfect timing, train on track there guys. Anyways, I am absolutely freezing my fingertips off here guys. It's literally four and a half degrees Celsius right now and i got to be really, really honest. Last night we had the craziest thing happen. Literally, I can't remember, it must have been gone like 9 o'clock, coming up to 10 o'clock, around about that time. Me and Yvonne was uh, sat in the uh, the hub, as we like to call it, and uh, we were like chatting about different things for the future. All of a sudden, like, bang, and it was like, what the hell? And we heard a couple of more bangs outside, and we thought, was that thunder? And I thought, I didn't see any lightning. So I did a little bit of a video, shared it onto um, my page, and... Uh, Quite a few people was like, well, yeah, we heard it. And a few people were like, no, I didn't hear it. And I was like, crikey, it was like absolutely strange. But anyway, guys, I'm going to be heading into work right now and um, doing a uh, extra shift this week. And uh, then I'm going to be going home and having a nice Sunday dinner and spending the rest of my day with Yvonne. So I really wanted to say pretty much thank you ever so much to all of you awesome people for coming by. It means the world to me. Do your best to stay positive and screw all those negatives. And I'll see you in the next one. All right. Bye-bye.